this is Cindy. Welcome back to my channel. Hope everybody's having a great day. And we're going to have some jewelry sale. And the first item is this brooch. I didn't show this brooch last time. I mean, I didn't get a chance to show them all. And this one is the rose. And look at this. It does have a little tiny enamel loss. That's how it looks like on the inside. And that's the pin. I don't see no maker's mark or anything. But for number one, it's going to be $2. For number one. And then number two. This is number two. This is, I believe it's just costume or that's the back part of it. And number two is going to be a dollar. And I have like um, some sterling earring. And I have to do some testing. Okay, this is number two for a dollar. And then the number three. This one is um I'm not sure if this is look at this one. That's how it looks like in the back and that's like I don't know if you could wear it as a pendant or and that's number three. Okay, number three is going to be $3. Okay, that's $3 for number three. And then number four. Number four is this. Beautiful brooch. And that one's going to be $2 for number four. Okay, $2 for number four. And then number five, this one's a little bent and a little um, color loss on the back. But in the front is still beautiful. Seems like a little tiny color loss right here. It's a little bent right there. And for number five, it's going to be $2. Okay, $2 for number five. And then number six. This is number six. And that's the back. And I'm not sure if that's a maker's mark or is. Okay. And then that one's number six. It's going to be $2 for number six. Okay. I thought I had more brooch. Um, okay, $2 for number six. And then number seven. This one does have some, some wear or some color loss. See in the back? And it says Japan. That's how it looks like. And it's still beautiful on the front. We just have color loss or somewhere in the back. And that's number seven. It's gonna be a dollar. One dollar for number seven. Okay. 
one dollar for that and then number eight let's test it together let me um let me cut a Let me test the number eight together. It's this lovely, um, I'm not an amber expert, but look how pretty this one is. And this is how it looks like in the back. And let me see if it glow. Yeah, it does glow. See the glow? <clears throat> I'm like, where's the marking? I'm not sure if it's on the pose. Can't even see it. Let's test it and see if it's throwing. It's so hard to scratch the post. I'm just gonna. Okay. Let's see if it's third one. And it is blue and um Cindy's not an amber expert I don't see any maker's mark on it let me see I'm gonna check the post where is my loop I thought I had my loop here but I don't I might have put it in the other that is so weird. See, I'm not sure if it has any maker on the post. Can't even see it. And I don't know what I do with my loop. Mm. Thought I had it. That's so strange. Um, this is a beautiful earring. It's like a diamond shape, and that's number eight. Number eight is gonna be twenty dollar, okay? For number eight, I like how it's made. See the design, okay? Twenty dollar for number eight, and then number nine. Number nine, I have this pearl necklace. I'm not sure if it's real. I mean, I'm not sure if it's real pearl. But it's, oh, hopefully she don't get tangled. I'm so sad, my earring lap went missing yesterday. There's a lot of earrings, like 24 earrings. They delivered to the wrong house and I'm trying to call FedEx. And then this one's the extender.
and there go your blue. for the amber and for anybody who wants number nine Let's see see how one of it's it would glow huh um Let me give you the drop with the extender. This is with the extender. It's like eight and a half inch drop. And it's pretty. Number nine is gonna be $11, okay? $11 for number nine. And then number 10. a lot of testing this one is mark s is it sx925 tie Okay, I'm gonna scratch that one, and then I should scratch this one too. I like this one, it doesn't, um, well, I think that's how it looks like. Let me scratch this one. It's kind of hard to scratch the bead. See, the bead doesn't even want to scratch. So I'm not even sure if the beads are sterling. Oh, there you go. I got some scratch right there. And there go your blue. I don't want it to drip. Okay, number ten. Let me show you guys again for number 10. That's the marking in the back. SX925 tie. And I'm not sure what the the black um stone are. Okay. Anybody who wants number 10 is gonna be $20 for number 10. $20 for number 10. And then number 11. And I do I have any more plastic bags? Number 11 is that other one. This is number 11. 
and can't even see the marking on it. And this one's going to be $10 for number 11, okay? $10. Yeah, I have another um lot coming today. Hopefully, it will arrive safely. That one's going to be a good lot. And then number 12 is this one. This one is so pretty, too. And I'm not sure if I could see the maker's mark or if there's any marking or not. I can't even see it. Okay. Let's scratch it. My stone thing's not that dried, hopefully. Okay. I'm gonna scratch another earring. This one is pretty too. I wonder what stone is it? Rhodonite? See? And this one has a little weight to it. It's like it's pretty thick. Uh, let me clean that spot out. I can scratch this one. You see the blue, blue, blue. Let me scratch this post again. Because sometimes it's like. The scratch looks good. See the blue and where are we at now? Number twelve. Look at this little earring. It's cute. Um ten dollar for number twelve. Ten dollar and then number thirteen. And this is number thirteen and it does have marking in the back. This one does have a little weight. Let me measure the the weight. It's beautiful. 8.8 .8 gram. Wow, 8.8 .8 gram. It'll be $13, okay? For number 13. $13. For number 13. And then number 14. This one. I like this one. Look at that. It's Tiger's Eye, I believe. Oh, let me clean my stone. It's still not dried. Mm. 
I'm glad some of you guys enjoy the testing. Um. And then it's going to be hard for me to test this tassel. It's hard to scratch it. The post is scratch is good. And then let me scratch this one too. This one looks like just shell. I'm like, where's my other earring? I'm missing another side of the earring. Oh, it's right here. You guys see the blue? And let me do the tiger's eye. One of them does look a little bit tarnished than the other. And the marking right there. You see, this side looks like darker than this side. And that one is number 14. I like that one. Number 14 will be $14, okay? And then number 15... is the shell. The marking is right there. Can't even see it. Um, six dollar for number fifteen. Six dollar for number sixteen. I mean, for number fifteen. Sorry. Okay, number fifteen is six dollar, and then number sixteen. Let's do this scratch. <laughs> scratch, scratch, scratch. It's this little tiny. I'm not sure what it is, just a heart. And a crown, is it? Where is the other side? It's so small, I just had it. It's right here. I was working this weekend. I didn't have a chance to do a video. And plus, my earring lot was missing yesterday. It was so sad. I was like waiting to do it together. And let me do this one too. And this part. And then this one looks like either a brass or a gold tone in the middle. See, it looks, it comes out copper in the middle. So I don't think that's sterling. That's weird. How would they put copper? And I see the bottom one. See, that's the bottom part. The uh, back part. It just say bars. Nine two five. 
but this one is not sterling in the middle because that one come out copper okay see the copper one the copper one went away <laughs> And they're very blue, except for the copper. Okay. And number 16. Let me show you guys the back. It looks like a happy face in the back. 925. Number 16 is going to be $7. Seven dollar and for number sixteen is a beautiful heart. And then number seventeen. For the bars. Just want you guys to know the middle part is not sterling. For number seventeen. It'll be twelve dollar, okay? For number seventeen. Twelve dollar. And then number eighteen. This one's number eighteen. This is number eighteen. I'm not sure if that's garnet. They say it's garnet, but I'm not a hundred percent. Let's clean this one out. And then test it. And then let's test this one. This one's the back, how it looks like in a bag. Okay. Let's test that too. And then it should be, that's it for this video. And there go your blue, 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 blue. Um, For number 18... the marking in the back that's how it looks like in the back and number 18 is gonna be ten dollar okay number 18 and then number 19 This is so pretty. Seven dollar for number nineteen. And then that's it for this jewelry so Hope you guys enjoy it. I want to thank each and every one of you for watching. And please like, comment, and subscribe. And Cindy will see you guys in the next one. Bye. Thanks for watching.